Hello, everybody. This is Mary Wasabi, and we are going to get started on histograms today. So this is lesson four, histograms. We're going to take an interval frequency table, which is this, and we're going to create a histogram out of it. So like a histogram is a bar graph that touches. So the bars do not have a space in between. So the bars will touch on like a regular bar graph. So first thing we want to do is look at the set of data. And all these numbers are like hat sizes for uniforms and baseballs, uh, baseball team. So these are the head circumference in millimeters. And what they did was they took an interval from 510, size 510 to less than um, 530. So when it's 530, it doesn't get recorded in this category, it has to get recorded in this category. Cool thing is, is they put them in order from least to greatest. So when we're going through this, we're looking for the 510s to 529. So we have one, two. So I'm going to put two tally marks and the frequency is going to be two. And then 530s to 550s. So 549 is the biggest. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Notice how the fifth is a streak. That's what we have to do. Then we go to the next one. We got to go up to 569. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And then we have 570 to 590. So we have to go to 589. There's nine. And then 591 to, so 590 to 609. And then the last but certainly not least, there's two. And we just checked to make sure we have them all. So you could double check your data. And now we're going to make a histogram out of the data. So making a histogram out of data looks like this. So how do we make the histogram? We first of all straighten this out. All right. So there's bottom title, head circumference, um, vertical title, frequency, how often it occurs. We start off, we make our vertical line, meeting our horizontal line, meeting at zero, and then we pick a pattern. And these numbers are quite small, so we can go 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, go slightly over the highest number you have. And at the bottom, we have to put these intervals. But you notice how it has to start with zero, and we got to get all the way to 5, 10. Well, that just shows you that we're going to make this thing right here, this little zigzag. It's called a break. So the zigzag is called a break, and it allows us to make a big jump in the numbers so that we don't have to go um, 0 to 5, uh, 0 to 20, 20 to 50, so on and so forth. We can just go zero, da, 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 first head size. Okay, so this one is done for us. We go up to the two over and down. That's what they did there. Then 530s to 550s, it went up to eight. So we connect it, it touches. It's a friendly bar graph. So 550 to 570 is 15. So we go up to where the 15 would be located, which is right between. If you need a ruler, you use it. Otherwise, you follow the grid on the graph paper. Okay, and then we can color that in. And then 570 to 590 goes up to 9. And it comes down, it touches, and then it goes over to the 4, up to the 610, and then 2. And now let's say that there wasn't any numbers, any um, hat sizes that was 570 to 590, then you would have nothing in between right there, but you would still represent the number. Okay, so I'm going to let me put that 9 back there. So don't erase that, just go with that. And that is how you make a histogram. You take it out of the data, 
You're not putting space in between the bars. Every bar tower must touch. And this is called an interval frequency table because there's a set of numbers. It's not just how many times is the 510 represented? How many times is the 511? It's all numbers between 510 to 530. So it includes 510, but it doesn't include 530 because it's only a less than sign. It's not an equal to sign. Hope everything makes sense. We tried to keep uh, it nice and simple. And remember all the numbers that we're putting, all the data points that we had earlier all had to be in order from least to greatest. Have a great night.